According to a report from Bloomberg, the United States has increased its contribution to Taiwan's military capabilities this week, bringing the total to 480 million US dollars. This increase includes a combination of grants that can be used directly in the US and drawdowns from US inventories. The US Department of State informed lawmakers of this development and raised the foreign military financing FMF, available to Taiwan by an additional 55 million US dollars. Interestingly, these funds were redirected from the originally allocated budget for Egypt. This comes on top of the 80 million US dollars in FMF funding for Taiwan that was previously communicated to the US Congress on August 31st. It's noteworthy that the United States had previously limited the utilization of this funding mechanism to specific major allies like Israel and Egypt. As also echoed by Focus Taiwan, in a significant move, the White House had previously announced in late July that Taiwan would be allowed to draw down 345 million US dollar worth of equipment and arms from US inventories, although the specific items were not detailed. According to documents from the State Department, the FMF funding can be employed to acquire a wide range of equipment, including air and coastal defense systems, rocket artillery, the widely used US air defense and counter-rocket system known as CRAM, counter-drone systems, as well as equipment for soldiers and small arms. The package could include four unarmed MQ-9A reconnaissance drones, the purported provision of MQ-9A drones should not be confused with a contract that the US Air Force signed with General Atomics Aeronautical Systems in May to supply Taiwan with four MQ-9B Sky Guardian drones. It's important to note that the authorization for this FMF funding for Taiwan was included in this year's defense policy bill, allowing for appropriations of up to 2 billion US dollars per year through 2027.